Hello! First and first, back at it again with another quest for the best. This time, we got the good old classic pizza. We're hitting up three hot spots in Fort Collins, so we have our most affordable category, we're gonna have our mid-range category, and we're gonna have our classiest, more sit-down kind of a restaurant category. We're off! We get some pizza! So this is going to be the first stop. The cheapest option that we have. We went for buy the slice. Probably the cheapest place you can get a slice that's like the size of your face. $3.25 for a single slice that's, yeah, ginormous. And uh, we just went with, you know, little pepperoni. One of the crucial things of this place. Spicy Ranch. Mm. Pretty bomb. Just like a basil leaf or something right here. They got a nice like flavor in there. Pretty thin crust, but not overly crispy. The uh, appearance reflects the price, which is great. It's fine. There's nothing wrong with it. It's the perfect thing you want to eat when you're either drunk or hungover. Definitely greasy and delicious and wonderful. We gotta save room though because we yeah, have two more stops to make here. Two whole stops. I mean, that's two whole pizzas. Two these faces. So, we just finished up at Cosmos, stop number one, and uh, definitely pretty legit. I'd say most definitely worth the $3.25. Definitely bomb. That spicy ranch. Ah, that's the way to go. Makes that's, it. That's everything sure. right there. So we're off to uh, stop number two. Which is crazy carol. Alright, we're here over at uh, Crazy Carl. This is our medium range uh, pizza joint. We got a jalapeno popper pizza here. This thing's got pepperoni, jalapenos, uh, bacon, and cream cheese. That's right, cream cheese. Super delicious. First thing that you're gonna notice is the uh, crust is nice and glistening. It, I think they, they do some sort of garlic butter on there. It smells amazing, so we're about to do the taste test. First, cheers. Uh, uh, first casualty. Okay, I'll pour it hot. Man, there's just so much more sustenance. It's not so thin. The cream cheese, it's like all like toasted on the outside, so it's like kind of crispy, and then you bite in, and it's all gooey and gooey. And then you have the crunchiness of the bacon. You got the spicy jalapenos. Oh, oh man, it's just, it's almost a perfect pizza version. It's pretty in your mouth. Hey, so just wrapped up at Crazy Carl's. Oh man, that oh. place has a spot in my heart. It's very worth the price. Uh, I mean, the whole thing was 14 bucks. You get 10 slices of pizza. It's 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 good. It's dank and delicious. It's everything you could ask for. Dank pizza, dank price. Definitely a good mid-grade. We got one more stop to make. We're going to the biggest, baddest of them all. This is supposedly the best pizza in Colorado. Bojo's Pizza. Let's bring it out. <laughs> So we're at stop number three. Here we are at uh, Bojo's Pizza. This is the mountain style little Italy pizza. And uh, oh, it is monstrous. We've got pepperoni, we've got like olive oil, we've got roasted garlic, uh, basil. It's just like a wonderful Italian classic pizza. We're about to go in on this, um, this um, see what's up, see if it's actually worth everything it was. Three pounds, 32 bucks. So definitely the most spendy, definitely the highest uh, quality. Looks like we got like stuffing in the middle. All right, let's see what it's all about. The crust is way better. Higher quality for sure. It's like really, really good dough. The mushrooms on the inside, crispy and flaky, but stuffed. Oh man, the roasted garlic, 
and the oils and all of the wonderful flavors are combining in such a way. This is a legit pizza. Right, cheers, sir. Cheers to bomb pizza all day. We just got done at spot number three, Bojo's Pizza. Yes. Definitely bomb. The, the Little Italy is the one we got. There were so many options. It was kind of hard to choose, actually, because they had some really, really good ones. But um, I don't know. Versch, what do you say? Overall, was it worth the $32 for that monster of a za? I mean, in my personal preference, um, it was good. It was dank. It was delicious. However, I would say Crazy Carl's is probably going to be the most worth it price-wise and taste. Crazy Carl's, in my book, took took the cake there. At this point, we're just so full of pizza, I'm about to explode pepperonis every which direction, but, um... Mainly on my belly button. Right, 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 right out of the belly button, just pop. Really good pizza, about to fall into a, a pizza coma, essentially. So, thank you for watching. I hope you go and try out these pizza places yourself. Let us know what you guys think of the video. Like and subscribe if you dig it. We do one every single Monday. So holla at your boys if you fucks with us. Hey!